Hey there guys, my name is Sage Chen, we are continuing now with part 14, with the rescue of Evelyn. I do apologise, as the last part I will admit was a little bit messy and it did kind of glitch it a little bit. So apologies for that once again. If you are enjoying these, let me know by hitting that like button, go subscribe if you are brand new to the channel. But, without further ado, let's get right back to where we left off. So, oh no. Let's go and get, uh, Evelyn out. Evelyn, you okay? Alright, let's do no, this. No, let's do this, come on. You okay? Oh, she looks Wait off it. Signal. Jesus Christ. Ready? Oh. And... Now. I hope she is not dead. I hope she is not dead. Oh, I hope we did it right. Thank God. Okay, we did it. Evelyn, I think we did it. Me? Did we do it? Uh, who hired you to? She okay to be moved? I don't Normal know. Brain hemorrhages, damage to the spine. Doesn't seem to have any wounds. She looks to be okay. Choice. What's wrong with her? What's wrong with her? Honestly, I don't know. She's got to be seriously traumatized. She doesn't seem like she can talk, so I'm just Let's gonna say just safe. get her out and ask her Fast. later instead if we can. Which way? I sealed the doors and managed okay. to power the elevators. Elevators it is then. Alright, let's go. Oh, Johnny's here. He's just having a little peek, seeing what we're doing. Alright, looks like we just need to go and get her in the elevator. Damn. Whatever they did to her, she's like literally out of it and her nose is all bloody and everything. And yeah, it's just, it's just a bit gross, you know. So let's just, uh, yeah, let's go to the elevator right here. And I presume this is just a little quick time lapse getting her out and everything. So right, this will go in any second now. Okay, well, that was um, interesting. Yeah, we could have gotten quiet. But you know what, we just decided to go in loud for some reason, but I love how the game does give you that option of going in either quiet or loud, because then it doesn't really sit there and then tell you to be like, oh, you have to do this, you have to do that. They just say, no, go in however way you feel like it, which they literally do say, no joke. Come on, is it really that hard? Please, just one. For me? No fucking way. Smoking's for posers, and it stinks too. Say whatever the fuck you want, but just light up. No. Non-smokers are the fucking worst. Just my luck. <laughs> we going in? Uh, yeah, it looks like we're going in. Uh, yeah, uh, what's there to wait for? What's there to wait for? Didn't go through hell and back just to stand in front of the door. Oh. oh, what's happening? Relic malfunction detected. Uh oh. Okay, is everything okay? Let's go and talk to Judy. If we can. Oh god, looks like we're having a little bit of a tipsy turpsy around the place. Oh, well, that's good. I think she is. Her eyes are closed and she's not shaking anymore. Okay, we're all screwed. I would have already killed her by now if I didn't feel so bad for her. Uh, you're not mad at her? How is she holding up? Uh, we already found that out. Need to talk I to need her. need to talk to her. Listen, I know you've got some serious questions that she's got the answers to. I mean, if I were you, I'd want to know too. But it's just not gonna happen. She's completely out of it. You've got to be fucking kidding me. <laughs> you're mad at her. You're mad at her? Why? <laughs> when you asked me to scour her behavioral chip, I was just about done dealing with your shit. Judy, I didn't have any I know. Other... It's okay. So I don't get why... You'll find out in a sec. I'll show you the virtue I found. Oh, so something did happen. You already watched them already. How many BDs are they? Guessing you saw them already. Yeah. Had to wrestle to make sense of the whole thing. Oh. But I don't want to say anything and taint your perspective. You should go in with fresh eyes. Okay. Okay. Sure. Right, might as well see. I'm curious to see what she was actually up to. 
Guess we'll find out if our doll really did lose her tune. Come on, V. Let's do this. I want to see what I'll she was actually up to. This does not look good. Uh, how are you feeling? Uh, I have something to ask. If she doesn't no, reply, we'll just touch. But I gotta ask. You got any idea how to remove the biochip? Or know anyone else who might? Hopefully she knows something. Uh, we'll ask one more time. Listen, Evelyn. I really need your help. It's important. If she doesn't I'll reply, do we'll just turn her we'll over. Soon. I hope she hasn't I'll died. Die. I have a feeling like she might have. Alright, let's touch. Oh. Oh. Don't freak her out. Don't freak out. Oh, she's jerking. Okay. Well, now, look at you. <laughs> oh, wait, Johnny. How are you feeling? Hey. How are you feeling? You need anything? Yeah, it doesn't look like she's going to reply. Just talk. You're right. This is a complete waste of time. Alright, let's go. It was worth a try. It was worth a try. Okay. Well, let's go. Have fun, Evelyn. Just been sat there doing God knows what. Okay. Have a seat. Oh, let's use some of this bad boy. Sorry, I just Loki ate your lunch right there. All right, roll it. Data was in pretty rough shape. Okay. Not all that editable. Let's have a little look. Glad you managed to salvage them in the first place. Need to. Oh, we're going back in here again. Okay. Let's do Quality's this. Lousy, but I did what I could. I'll be curious to see what Evelyn's actually been up to then. So maybe this might give a little bit of light on how to remove the biochip, aka so making us basically see Johnny Silverhand, Night City Legend. Or it might lead on to more questions, I don't know. I don't think I'll find the answer straight away if I'm going to be honest, but I do feel like genuinely we will find something that might lead on to more questions than answers or it might just be some general clues i might just be over analyzing but what's well, after just wait and see what am i looking out for every single piece of tech i see security pause okay let's rewind that because we found something there okay let's take a little bit of a looky round now who's this under normal offer. circumstances, that kind of encryption's easy to crack. But not this time. Oh. Whoever she is, she's got serious net running skills. Looks like yeah, she has. Someone's working it for her. Hmm. I think I recognize these. They're are they? they? Vive markings. You familiar with them? Not enough to know what they actually mean. Heard of who okay. might use them, though. Every single piece Could of be tech the boys, that's just a we need a layout of the whole. Can't be hundred percent sure. We will get everything else we need from that runner crew. Hard to find because messages? they don't want to be. I wouldn't know where to Only start. Only if you can do it and be tough, bully. It's most important that he suspect nothing. Try to be your usual relaxed self. And if he starts talking about the biochip himself, might not be important. Uh, Maybe. All of them are from Pacifica. Lies. I was down our search at least. What now? Well, let's continue. Like I'm and going on a field trip. He starts talking Pacifica. about the biochip himself. Will you give it? Should I? That is not of interest to you. You spin the virtual, you come back here. We give you the eddies. That is your one job. Okay. The rest is none of your concern. Understand. Alright, looks like we found out what we need to do then. We're going to Pacifica then, it looks like. Okay. That was interesting. So, looks like we got somebody to find that apparently Evelyn worked for. That has got serious hacking skills. Hopefully it's not too much of a big competition, but... I'm going to be curious to see where it's late. I don't know if we've been to Pacifica yet. Sorry, I nearly pronounced that wrong. 
but let's go and find out where it is. I'd be curious to see what it is myself, actually, if I'm going to be honest. Oh, this is getting exciting. Very, very exciting. Evelyn wasn't completely honest with us. A woman who hired her. Now I don't know why they tried to flatline her. Now we know what happened to Clouds. They're the ones who tried to flatline her. Launched a nuke at her chip. So it was punishment? For getting hmm. played by her? She knew more than they thought she knew. Couldn't let that go. So that's who she was running from. The woman who hired who her. Who hired Evelyn? Any idea who we're up against? Your guess is as good as mine. Sorry, V. It looks like Evelyn never told us the whole truth. She looks like she didn't. If I'd known what she'd gotten herself into, I was so mad at her. Her only job was to record a virtue. Pretty it's simple. Pretty damn amazing she managed to organize a full-blown heist. And swipe the biochip from under her boss's noses. So that's where you came in. She hired you. And brought this all on herself. On you too. Pretty much, because we're nearly dying. Want to see it? Yeah, why not? Sure, why not? Might as well. Surprise me at this point. Let's do this. I wonder what this next recording might be. Of. So that first recording looked like to be reveal her boss or whoever hired Evelyn, and then Evelyn hired us to do the whole heist that ended up going completely wrong. Then. It now looks like we're going to see another record, so maybe more of this mysterious woman, maybe? I'm not too sure. Oh, uh, I don't know. I'm going to have to find out from what it looks like. Okay. It's fully loaded now, let's see. Oh, is this her? What language is she speaking? I don't know. Haitian Creole? It is the voodoo boys. Didn't I? Wait, let me see if I've got an auto translator. Meantime, Let's try this you again. try to tune into the phone's frequency. See what the other side's saying. Try scanning the phone. Got it. Give it a second. Okay, let's see what the, they're actually saying. Have to know what they're saying. We have to know what they're saying. Could be important. Could be. Fine. Just found the auto translate package. Should get along fine okay. with your system. I'll install it now. Oh, we're uploading something. Okay. Well, let's see what they end up saying. Are they saying anything? I wish I shared your confidence. That silver handle lead us through. You better have the idea. Good, then if you don't question my judgment, you can get back to work. Oh, okay. Okay, Judy, we're good. Alright, disconnecting. This is all connecting up in a really weird way, so... With all of this, this might have originated from them. This might be because of all them. We don't know. We just have to wait and see then, I guess. Which absolutely sucks, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, Dab. Okay. God, this is getting really interesting now, the story. So I did have a sort of right feeling that it is answering a few questions, but it's making a few more. Like, who are these people and why they're doing what they're doing? Okay, I really don't know. Long story. His construct on the bio trip. Uh, we get it together. A biochip we stole. It's uh, it's got Silverhand's engram burned onto it. Engram? Digitized psyche, personality construct. <laughs> Give me a minute. I need to go over some stuff in my head. Uh, um, of course. <laughs> Oh, so she gets the idea that basically somebody's there in her head. A.K.A. Johnny Silverhand. 
Now to find these people. Uh, these people could be Wolf. Uh, okay, yeah, let's see. Are, who the woman is? Any idea how we find them? Fuck V. I've been <laughs> dead the last half century. Sorry <laughs> if I'm unable to hand you all the answers on a chrome fucking platter when you snap your fingers. <laughs> these people, what could they want from Alt? How the hell should I know? Got no notion whatsoever? One way or another, everything leads back to that net runner. Finding her is our biggest priority. If she knows as much as I think she knows about the chip, she can help us out. Thought you said nothing could help us. Nah, just find us that juju wirehead, okay? Okay. Alright, looks like we need to go outside and talk Wait, to Judy. You got any idea how to get in touch with the Voodoo Boys? Uh, I better get going, I'll ask around. I'll ask around, make a few calls. Let me put it this Looks way. Looks like we're gonna. The Voodoo Boys wouldn't trust a cat if it walked onto their turf. But someone's gotta know a way in. Well, good luck. I hope you won't need it. Yeah, me too. Thanks. Thanks, Judy. No, V. Thank you. You're a... You're a good person. Oh, how Evelyn kind. I could never see what was under people's skin. If she could have gotten to know you a bit better, then... Who knows? Things might have turned out differently. Sure, they could have. Okay, well thanks, Judy. We're gonna go now. Let's leave the apartment. And... See where this leads us now. Call Mr. Hands. Okay. Well, we have not seen him for quite a bit, but oh, who are all these people? Jesus Christ. I'm standing here. Yep, we can see you standing there. Okay, let's call Mr. Hands then. Uh, yeah, let's give him a little call. V, what's shaking? Need to make contact with the Voodoo Boy's chief if you can swim. Oh. All right, all right. Straight to heavy business. Hmm. Now, that'd be Maman Brigitte. Be tough getting a word into her. Uh, don't do business with them. Thought you could arrange anything. I was led to believe you could arrange anything. Ah! Now that sounded like my third wife every time she wanted a new purse. Maman Brigitte. And that sounds like a spooky cult alias. I've not had the pleasure of asking her personally, but it is what everybody calls her. Doubt the title has any real religious weight, though. Voodoo okay. boys play pretty fast and loose with their Haitian heritage. You really don't do any biz with them? That's a shame. Not with the chefs, chefins, priests, and whatnot. All got dirigible-sized egos, won't talk to lowly me. But if you insist, I can ask around, try to set something up. I'll just need some details first. Like? What details? Got something they want? Uh, got something they want. Truly? Want to sell something to the VDBs? Trust me, they don't want it, they don't need it. They're isolated, insulated, they got their own contracts, tech, networks. But, have it your way. Okay, I'll see what I can do and get back to you. Alright, Mr. Hans, thank you, thank you very much. Okay, so now it looks like we gotta go and pursue these uh, other leads right here until Mr. Hans calls back, okay?